Good morning and welcome to Found in the Ground. Here we are at the Medieval Farm. I'm joined with guests today. Kevin, how you doing? Yeah, very good, thanks. Kev's a brother of a, a mate of mine from work and he's come out today over to my permission at the Medieval Farm. Um, we've got Colin on the camera, bless him, he's doing ever so well. <laughs> we've got a couple of fields, one with some um, stubble, it's all rotted away, and we've got um, an X beet field as well, which is a bit mucky, both of which have given me hammered in the past, so there's high hopes that uh, we'll get some. What are you hoping for, Kev? A few hammer coins. A I'm, few? Yeah, a few. I want at least three or four today. Should be good. He's really hoping, isn't he? Wrong side of uh, Norfolk for that, I think. But there we go. We'll be optimistic. I'm hoping for at least one or two myself. So I've got to say, I'm on there. Colin, I hope you get a couple as well. Right, enough talking from, up, from us. Let's get out there and let's get digging. Kevin's getting excited. He thinks he's onto a hammer, but I've also got quite a nice signal. Got a solid 15. Yeah, lovely. We'll have that. On the sniper coil today, as is Colin. Kevin's on the big boy. Big boy Cortex has come down to a 13. Oh, it's right there on the top. Ah, it's a broken part of a crotal bell. A part fact to start the day. Noise. Coin. First coin of the day. Indeed, it's only about the second hole of Doug. Looks like a really thin... It's not going to be a button. It's a waffer thin little farthing sized jobby. Right, I'll give it a clean up and see if I can get an ID on it. Not a lot coming up. Very diseased. I think I'm going to just have to call it a farthing of nothingness. Oh, that's the strike for the date. Urgh. Maybe a Georgie? I think I can see a head to the left. It might be an old one, you know. I think it might be a George the Fourth. Not a fifth. Nah. Anyway, farthing. First coin of the day. Boom. Wow. Screaming. Jumping. No. That's it. Oh yeah. Cool. Lovely. 21, 22. Could it be a coin? Certainly sounding nice. It's in that blob there. And the sun's come up, which is lovely. Oh, got a, a round in the ground. It's the wrong colour. Not supposed to be green. Who wants silver? And gold. Oh, and oh, and it's a button. Why are you there? You've got no right to give those kind of signals. You beast! Oh, right, there's Kevin. Oh god, Kevin's right over there. Colin's over there. We're heading to uh, hopefully what I think is richer ground. Richer than this darn button anyway. Got a cheeky 19. I was reading right on the surface. Which it is not far off. Oh yeah. Just enough that I've got to give it a little bit of a dig. Ah, coin, another one. <laughs> uh, it's looking half penny size, that one. Ta da! Right, what's this one? Should be a bit easier, he says. I think it's a Georgie Fifth. Yeah, Georgie Fifth. Good day to you, sir. 19. Mm. 1919 I think it's 1919 half penny fabulous second coin of the day I do not mind that I've only been going about half hour perfect I think I can see a rim and a worm a worm 
Welcome along, get away from my treasures. All right. So, is it a buttony rim or a coiny rim? Mm. Have a look. Oh, nothing shanky yet. Oh, anything shanky on this side? No. Another coin, third coin already. Right, I'll have a little clean up, see if we can find out what it is. There she is, tis a coin of utter and complete nothingness. Probably a farthing of some description at some point, probably, maybe, yes. Okay, three coins, boom. Having a walk with Colin, because we've heard the words hammered come up. A word. Hammered! <laughs> Kev's on it. You got hammered, buddy. There's one of me four I'm gonna find today. That's a little bit toasted. One of the four. You can just. Oh yeah, let's pop it in. See it. Oh, lovely. That's the Tudor. That's a good that side. Is it Elizabeth? Is the it? other side's not so good. Oh no, it's nice. It's nice, though, isn't it? Yeah, you've got the nice the rose there. So what's that? Um, a threepence, isn't it? Look at that. Really Elizabeth nice portrait. The Elizabeth the first. Three pence. Well done, mate. Lovely So that's job. one down, three to go. One down, three to go. This land is so easy to dig. <laughs> it is amazing. It's a dream, isn't it? And you're on the knocks with a big boy call. Yeah. Whereas we're on the small ones. You can swing that to your heart's content and the signals just bounce that out there. There Brilliant you go. Coil. Can't say enough about it. Right, look at that. That's fabulous. Well done, mate. Can you see it? It's the obligatory find of the day. Just saying to the guys, I don't find many of them over here. On the other field across the road, millions of them. It's a lovely musket ball. It looks unfired. As again, a lot of them are over here. I wonder if that's spilled from that other field. I think there was a camp there before a battle. Knowing the, uh, the history of this area, I think that's what happened. Anyway, that's a lovely example of a musket ball. So Kev's just pulled up a button. Can't have it every time, can you? Oh, there you go, a little four-holer. Lovely old job. Thought it was gonna be lead, turned out to be a button. Turned out to be a button, Never mind. Maybe the next one. Another beautiful wormy. Thanks for keeping the ground awesome, dude. But hey, another pistol ball. Or oh, another, another musket ball, pistol ball, you know one of them flipping perfect again why do you keep dropping them all clumsy mm. aren't they clumsy he says yes well here we go I had a little round in the ground flop over here she is and I wonder if it's going to skunk me and be a button but saying that it's a fairly convincing penny of nothingness isn't it Oh, is there some detail? Is there? Could it be? May we be able to know what this coin is? <sighs> Let's clean it up. Hey, this is really interesting. You see that? Something of change? Is it the winds of change? I don't know. Very odd, it's a token. I shall of course research it got it's like a castle of tower gates to say London mm, gosh I can't make it out I really can't it's difficult um, yeah anyway something different a 1600s token I expect yeah fascinating lovely old job can you see a peeper peeping? What have we got here? It's Batonius. Oh, what should I show you? Yes, little Batonius, Tombacius. I've still got a hole in my glove. Ooh, getting a cold little pinky there actually. Right, okay, button, yeah, wonderful, mm, brill. So Colin, you um, basically went back to the car and put the big boy on, yeah? I did. I want to cover a bit more ground. You do, and, and the stubble's not too high. But on the sniper coil, before you did that, you picked up this. Yeah, a little jewel. 
yeah look at this there's a bit of gilding around the edges it's obviously a diamond of some significant value i would assume <laughs> off a brooch or something yeah not bad mate okay yeah on field one on field one yep as in the settings not the field that we started no, no, on. Field one on the machine, <laughs> on the machine. <laughs> yeah nice one mate nearly back to the car and uh this little gem pops up again part of a crotal bell and it would have been fabulous so much fanciness going on yeah gutted that uh it's not even anywhere near complete but hey there we go that is detecting for you right fingers crossed i'm going to get a bacon roll in me now Oh my god, that's a screamer 25. 25, 26. It's going to be a coin, isn't it? Every day of the week. It's not even midday. And I've got a finds pod absolutely swollen. Awful word. Oh, don't tell me that. What is that? No wonder that was screaming away. Oh, it looks like a thing. You know? Like a... It looks like a thing. Like a big... Something. That I couldn't possibly come up with a... It's just odd. But it's not old. And it's not cool. And it's not a coin. Boo! Um, right. Heading back to the car for lunch which is going to be a bacon roll and maybe have an egg in it as well right see you later I've earned a life a wandering in I shone bright and my journey was over what I sought when I ran Was back where I began No matter the rain No matter the storm I'm coming home I'm coming home Leave open the gate Don't turn off the light I'm Well, I scratched in the dirt for a while I gained all that I knew for a price 